Joint Committee on Human Rights described parents as human rights defenders, and I very much saw myself in that role, but I didn't have the resources to do that. So I was very much self-taught. So I started to read the Mental Health Act, the government guidelines on restrictive practice. I, got, I went to events and tried to meet and talk to as many people as I could. And I was very glad to bump into to members of BIHR at some of those events and see some of their presentations. And I thought, fantastic, this is, this is gold dust to me. This is the vocabulary I need. This is the information I need. But wouldn't it be great if we could get a bit more information about things that were more CAM specific? So things that were happening to my son on a daily basis. And how do we challenge those very specific decisions? So it's been great to be able to work with Charlie and Hannah and share our experiences in really in a really quite positive um, but passionate way. 